Hello everyone, I am Garvit, a full stack web developer and in this video, I will be sharing all the courses that I took so far in order to become a full stack web developer. And this is not a paid video. I am not getting paid for, for any sort of promotions or anything. This is just an honest review video. And this video is for everyone who are just starting out to become a web developer. And you know, there are so many courses available on the internet and I am going to share all the courses that you need in order to become a web developer. So let's start this video and make sure that you watch this video till the end because in the end, I am going to share a very common pitfall that you definitely want to avoid. So make sure that you watch this video till the end. Let's start now. So I actually started by taking a web development bootcamp course by Cold Steely. It is a very good course. It is of around 65 hours, but I realized that this bootcamp course will only touch the basics <clears throat> because it is of only 65 hours. It has to include everything like HTML, CSS, JavaScript, Node, Express, and many other things. And, and just putting up everything in 65 hours, it, it clearly implies that instructor will only be able to teach you the basics. But if you want to learn any language in great detail, I will recommend you to take individual course. So I started taking individual courses on HTML, CSS, JavaScript, React and everything. And uh, I will share those courses uh, in, the, in the video. So I started by taking that bootcamp and I will say that if you are looking forward just to learn basics, then it is good to have a bootcamp. You will be able to finish that bootcamp in like two, three months. And after that, you can apply for internship and there you can keep on learning further by, you know, by actually working. So that is one way. But if you are someone who want to learn any language in great details, then I will not recommend you to take any bootcamp course. I will suggest that you should be taking individual courses because you know that bootcamp course which I took was of 65 hours but then I took a JavaScript course that was of 69 hours itself. So it is clear that the individual courses contains a lot more details than the bootcamp ones. You can learn things in bootcamp course as well but if you wish to deep dive into any language it is better to take individual courses. That's one thing to keep in mind. The first one is HTML and CSS by Jonas Schmidtman. The best part of this course is that he has covered all the details of HTML and CSS. Uh, you know, in, in CSS, there are so many things that you have to learn like responsive design layouts, which includes flexbox grids, and uh, and there are so many other things which you have to learn and this course is extremely good for that it has also included somewhat of web designing <clears throat> next course is on javascript and by the same instructor jonas schmidtman it is the course which i was talking about and it is of 69 hours in length and this is probably the best course that you will find on the internet jonas has covered everything related to JavaScript in so detail. He has he has covered basics which includes variables, loops and uh, conditionals, operators and everything in great details. And then he has explained some advanced stuff as well, which includes functions, higher order functions, arrow functions, object oriented programming, asynchronous nature of JavaScript. And then yes, one of the most important sections in this course is working of JavaScript behind the scenes. I made this mistake. I skipped this section. I didn't take it at the time in a correct way and I regretted it. So if you take this course, make sure that you understand this section extremely well. Even if you need to repeat it two, three times, do it. Next course is on React. And this course is from Mind by Maximilian Schwarzmuller. This course is great because because he has taught everything that you need that you need to know about react he has taught basics of react 
and then he takes you on the advanced side of react which includes you, uh, you know state management in react like uh, like context api and then redux and uh, redux toolkit these all are third party libraries which you can use to manage state in react and and you know in this course maximilian has taught almost everything with the help of projects there are almost 6 to 8 projects included in the entire course and these are very good projects so these were some of the courses on the front end part now comes the back end for for learning back end i took the node js course by maximilian schwarzmuller this course includes uh, node js express mongodb sql databases and uh, rest apis graphql and even web sockets as well you know one thing that i found about this course and and i just want to warn you that if you take this course i will suggest that you go a little slow because you know there are only two main projects in this course and instructor has taught almost everything through these two projects only so if so go a little slow learn everything step by step because if you miss anything chances are that you might not be able to understand a few things in the upcoming sections because everything is interconnected this is something which i uh, i i didn't follow i missed it over here and uh, and hence it took me little more time in order to completely understand the things <laughs> and then i took a very brave decision of learning typescript and in order to learn typescript i took a course from stephen grider this course is a little outdated i won't say outdated it is just a little old course it has been recorded a few years ago but but the instructor had made sure he has added instructions related to the latest advancements and latest updates and if you keep following those instructions you will not face any problem he has uh, he has included some really advanced level coding stuff like inheritance versus composition and that is a very great topic to understand and uh, he has also included a project on making your own framework using typescript and yes it is a great course i will recommend it it's just that it is a little you know old course besides these five main courses there were a few other courses that i took and these includes next js by academind and here is one more course web designing with figma with uh, and it was given by 02 mastery and there is this one more course which is advanced css and scss by jonas schmidtman these were a few other courses that i took and uh, and and these are all the courses that i have taken so far in order to become a web developer and i am sure that if you take these courses diligently you will be able to learn at least intermediate level stuff and uh, and because these courses include everything from basics to advanced stuff so yes i highly recommend taking these courses and here is the very common pitfall that many beginners fall into even i also made these mistakes for almost like 8 months or an year and then i started to correct these mistakes the mistake that i am talking about is just watching instructor's code and just copying and pasting everything from the instructor's code you know as soon as you learn the basics of any language you must start building projects you must start implementing those things on your own and try to come up with something new and unique no matter how many courses you take how much hours you spend watching videos if you are not making things on your own you will not progress anyhow because you must be able to implement on your own all the things that you have learned this is something which i made mistake and i just want you to know that making projects is the ultimate way of learning thank you so much friends for watching this video till now i hope that you found this video helpful and if you like the content make sure that you like this video and i will be uploading more such videos on this channel so please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon this will really help me a lot and uh, yes i will keep making more such videos so till then 
happy learning